Okay then people, uh, here's a bit of a puzzler for you. This is one of these uh, teleflies. You know the type of thing that follows the uh, tracks you're playing around the sky. Um, this ain't obviously ain't the tracker part, this is a telefly. This is the OSD, uh, what gives you your picture on the screen. Um, not a lot to it, quite simple really. You've got a GPS connected. Okay, pacing up. I can get satellites in this room. Um, I'm upstairs, uh, they will come. I get them with everything else I have with satellites, so uh, there's no worry there. The problem I'm having uh, is getting an on screen display to appear. I can get the video through. I'm using, just for a test indoors, I'm using a little 10 milliwatt 2.4 Fat Shark uh, video transmitter. Um, getting my power from a 900 milliamp uh, lipo. We have two little yellow, I don't know if you can see it, two little yellow wires coming out of the telefly <clears throat> with an earth in the middle. Uh, one of those is going off to the camera and one of them is, one of the yellow ones is sending a video out to the transmitter. Um, the earth is in the center. Now, in the instructions, these can be the wrong way around. I've checked them by putting them the other way around. You don't get any picture. Okay? Now, the idea is, is you plug the video camera into the balance lead. And you plug the telefly into the main lead. And a flashing light fl starts flashing telling you you have satellites. You can now also see on my monitor I have a picture. Okay? But the thing is there's no OSD. If I go in closer you can see no OSD. Now I can get an OSD to appear with a discovery this morning. If I unplug the video out and in cable and plug it back in again all of a sudden okay it's a bit skewy on the screen but there you go you can see an OSD now up in the top left hand corner you can't see it on this screen but it's actually saying 25 seconds okay now that's 25 seconds since I turned it on all right it doesn't change so it's not live it's not giving you live information However, if I unplug the lead, plug it back in again, I know you can't see it, but that has changed to one minute and three. The reason I know this is on my goggles, which you can't really see. Hang on, let's see if I can get them. No, I don't think you can see that, but I can. Um, you can actually read it. It's in view. So that's telling me that the telefly is working, although it's not updating on the screen. Now, every time I unplug this lead and plug it back in again, it updates. Okay, also, when you press the buttons, if I press the middle button on this, I'm meant to get a menu to appear. As you can see, no menu. Without pressing anything else, I pull out the videos, push them back in again. Now, you can see a display. Okay. Also, if I push these arrows, that's meant to take you up and down the menus, these outer buttons. In my case, again, it doesn't do it live, but if I unplug the lead and do it, let me just see. So if I press the button a few times, you can see the arrow is still at the top. If I just remove this lead, There you go, the arrow is halfway down the list. Okay, so the thing is functioning. 
it's just not going live out. It is a bit of a puzzler. I can't work it out. I've checked all of the wires with a voltmeter and um, all the connections are good. The earth's good um, because I thought to myself, okay, well, if you unplug the electrics again, which is basically powering the camera and the uh, video sender, which is all these leads are doing, plus an earth, um, that would work. But no, you have to unplug this lead and plug it back in again. It's got me puzzled. I can't work out why uh, this should be. Obviously, when it's in the plane, you can't keep unplugging this. And it seems also it won't uh, function properly, you know. Um, well, you know, you know the problems. You're all out there. You're all experienced people. Um, anyone got any ideas? Anyone had the same problem with this? Um, if so, let us know. Thanks a lot. Cheers then. Bye.